Hello and welcome to this week's vlog. As you can see, it's quite dark outside and I'm in my new lorry. I haven't got the headrests yet before you're looking at that in the background. Um, they were the only bit that they ran out of leather, so they're not quite done yet. Well, today we are going hunting at Holcomb Hall. So I haven't actually been hunting since I fell off, which you can see on here as well. Today is just like a chill day. It's three hours around Holcomb Estate. They've said it's more suitable for beginners and novice horses because there's. I don't think there's any jumps. It's not going to be super fast. So I thought it'd be an ideal one to just get back into. And I actually thought I'd take Will today because he's only been hunting once. Well hound exercising once so I thought it'd be nice to do like a proper hunt with Will and he's all clipped and fit and ready so I thought we'd take him have a bit of fun and as you can see I am completely solo today which is quite scary because I don't think I've ever in my entire life been anywhere with a horse by myself so I have super super prepared myself and got my tack on board, my rugs on board, emergency contacts, maps, <laughs> the whole shebang. I am super prepared because I've never been here before. Well I have, but with mum, she took me to the beach years ago and I've never driven this lorry, my lorry this far with a horse in before. So I am quite anxious, but I'm trying just to stay confident, stay chilled, and stay super on time. Because as soon as things get late, then you rush, then you forget things, so on. So I've set like loads of timers on my phone, so I don't forget anything. But that's today. And I'm so excited because it's supposed to be dry and Holcomb is supposed to be stunning. So I'm really looking forward to it. We're going to go to the yard now and get Will and hopefully he's not absolutely filthy. But I'm not going to plait him or anything because he's a mountain of moorland, he's very hairy, so he looks ridiculous plaited. But I did wash his mane and tail, so I've literally just got to grab him, groom him, load him. Should be simple. We'll see. We're already in here, we've got a big hay bag. We've put it in the bag because I don't want to get hay everywhere in the back here. So we'll see how successful that is. We've got a saddle, a bridle, a numna, a girth, travel stuff is here, I don't know how well you can see that, and then in the wardrobe, hunting jacket, hat, gloves, clothes, whip, boots, mountain block, water bucket, etc. So I think we're good to go. I've just got to feed the boys and sort Finley out with some hay. Yes. <laughs> And then we'll be ready Look to go. How frosty it is this morning. That's so typical that it's been mild. And this is the first time that I am driving on my own. And the ground's like rock hard this morning. But I have got another hour until loading time to get him ready and let him have his dinner go down. So hopefully by then, um, it won't be too bad and it's supposed to be like highs of seven today i think so it shouldn't be frozen by the time we get there in theory but yeah i hope the roads aren't too icy it's only one degree at the minute so i'm sure it'll be fine me just worrying all on board walk straight up Eat net. good boy yeah good boy. So we're now in Holcomb, we're just queuing to get through the archway. I don't know whether you can see because the sun is super bright, but there's Will. He's been really, really good travelling. Um, just a bit movie around the corners as Finley's a bit steadier, but so far so good. I did get a little lost, but I found my way back and hopefully I'm going to fit through this archway because I am bigger. Than that trailer. I just arrived at Holcomb and it's absolutely stunning. It's just on like a park estate. As you can see, the hall is just there, and we've got a lovely cushy spot on concrete. We have arrived. We are in one piece. Will is thinking, What the hell? You tired? Is that a long drive for you or just bad driving? Hey, you good boy. Will was thinking, Where the hell am I? I'm in a vehicle I'm not usually in with my mum. Where are the treats? Yeah. You 
you'll be all right. We'll get you out and take you up in a minute. Yeah. He is on the estate, just chilling, aren't you? He says, yep, yeah, next to my new lorry. He hasn't seen the hounds or anything yet. Have you? So we've just hopped on and we're going to be heading over to the hall. There's some horses now coming. I don't know whether you can hear the hounds, but they're going mental. And Will's just being a good boy. Been very patient. So we just thought I'd just show you a bit of the estate. trotted back down and it's absolutely beautiful the sun is now shining and you can see the um, memorial up there on the hill we're just waiting for a few horses to catch up and then we'll be off again Will's being fabulous he just doesn't pull which is lovely he just goes at the pace I ask him here come the hounds Good boy.
that. Boom. So I had the best time hunting. Will was foot perfect. He was such a good boy. He loaded perfectly, he traveled for me. I tied him up on the side of the trailer, lorry even. <laughs> got him ready on my own, got on him on my own, rode him on my own and he was just amazing. So I've had a really, really good time. Now to drive back and get back to reality and get back to going to work again. He is ready to go home. He's just looking out the window wondering where all the other horses have gone. But yeah, he's pretty good and it's lovely that I can see him whilst I'm going along. I've just got back and I'm so, so proud of this pony. I mean, how many ponies can you say you could take hunting out on your own, load them, get on them, took him out hunting in a snaffle, got off him, loaded him on my own. He's just super. I mean, he's very food orientated. But he was fantastic today. He wasn't lazy or anything. He didn't bronk. He's just a good boy. And I feel with him, I don't have to go flat out like with Finley. I can make him wait and sort of trail behind at my own pace, which is lovely. And you're just a good boy. And my arms don't ache because you don't pull. You're a good boy. He says, I'm starving now. I hope you've enjoyed this week's vlog of hunting um, I'm so proud of Will and our first outing ever on our own he was just an absolute superstar and I've had just a really pleasant time and I am freezing because it hasn't actually got above three degrees all day so I'm freezing so I can't wait to go home and get warmed up now thank you for watching please feel free to like comment and subscribe bye